The Good Life Tampa Bay TV show is about the people, places, and events that make great things happen here in the Bay Area. We love to go out and bring you the exciting stories and features that help make our city one of the greatest places to live and visit. So get ready to join me on another fun-filled journey to learn about some of the cool happenings right here on this episode of Good Life Tampa Bay. Hello, everybody, and welcome to this episode of Good Life Tampa Bay, this show that brings you the people, places, and events that make exciting things happen here in the Tampa Bay area. I'm your host, H. John Mejia. In our first segment, we check in with Steve and Julie Weintraub from the Golden Diamond Source and their recent exciting holiday VIP party. Let's take a look. Tonight, we're at the Golden Diamond Source for their annual VIP holiday party. For Steve and Julie Weintraub, tonight's a celebration, but also about giving back. Let's take a look. The holiday season is upon us once again, and the Golden Diamond Source and Julie Weintraub's Hand Across the Bay Charity celebrated another amazing year with a fun-filled and charitable evening with VIP customers, supporters, media, friends, and family. Uh, we're so excited. I mean, look at it. We have so many amazing friends and supporters that are here, and VIP clients at Golden Diamond Source. We're just really blessed. You know, we all look forward to this night, really. All year round, we look forward to having this VIP party a celebration for all our great clients that we have. I mean, it's just so hard for me. There's so many of them to get around, and, and I want to spend time with each and every one of them, but we're so grateful to everybody, Tampa Bay, everybody in this community for what they've done to us. We're so excited. I mean, we're happy that all of our VIP clients, you know, indulge us and really getting into the spirit of the holidays by giving three cars full of presents to families in need. So I think that's a magical thing about tonight. The holiday spirit filled the Golden Diamond Source and everyone in attendance was excited to start the season while enjoying music, great food, and of course shopping for some amazing jewelry. The food was provided by the continued support and friendship from the Courtside Grill. Everybody had their special reasons for supporting Steve and Julie Weintraub. Well, they lead by example. Okay, they want you to help others, they help others first. You join them. They don't ask you, you join them. They're going along full speed, you get in You get in with the crowd, you go with it. It's amazing, this has been such a great year. She's done so many things again, of course, in the community. We've had great fundraisers, fun, and the community again came out. Such a great cause, and then the party's awesome. Steve and Julie do so much all year long, so it's so cool for everyone to gather together at the end of the year to celebrate their accomplishments. And this is indeed the culmination of that. It's awesome. Oh my gosh, I love it. This is a party we never want to miss during the holiday season because it has it all. It has the glamour of Julie and Steve and all the beautiful diamonds and jewelry, but at the same time it has you know, the generosity, the spirit of generosity during the holiday season done in such a big way by them giving back so much to these to uh, people who Julie and Steve care so much about. Oh, tons of energy and we just love helping out Steve and Julie and particularly Julie for our Hands Across the Bay initiative. This, this, this domestic violence thing is just out of control. So anything we can do to help, we love to do it. Every year gets bigger. Every year gets more amazing. Every year there's more people here. But the most important part is just the giving back. It's amazing to come, enjoy the night, but also hear the amazing stories of everything that Steve and Julie have done in the community. And oh yeah, the new expanded Golden Diamond Source showroom was also on display. And the new expansion, I mean, that could not have come soon enough. So um, it's just been a great year, and we look forward to another great year after this. It is beautiful. It came out just like we expected. And fortunately for us, we have had year-to-year -year growth for the last 10 years. And good thing we have this because last Saturday we wouldn't have any place to put our customers. So we're so grateful. Our business is so good. The energy is so good in here. Ongoing supporters of the Hands Across the Bay charity were so proud to be sharing in the holiday festivities as well. They're so supportive of everybody. It's pretty amazing. I mean, everywhere we go, you see Julie and Steve's They've donated jewelry or they're involved somehow with helping. And anytime someone like a couple like that gives to the community, you want to give back to them. We love it. And Sherry is getting more and more involved. And she's going to be on the board of trustees. And I'm, I'm not supposed to say that. <laughs> I'm thrilled. Well, we love Julie and Steve very much. They are the most amazing people. We are very proud to work with them, always. I'll tell you what, like we said before, too blessed to be stressed. I mean, the blessings keep coming. You know, H, it's amazing. The people keep giving and so proud to be a part of Steve and Julie. The work that they do, a hand up, not a hand out. It's so amazing. And the people respond. They just want to work. So we're happy to be part of it. Now, one of the many special moments this year included the incredible recovery 
of Alyssa Dudley, who was shot three times, including in the head by her ex-boyfriend. Alyssa, despite losing most of the use of her right arm, made holiday crafts and was selling them to other attendees with part of the proceeds going back to Hands Across the Bay. I made all of these things with one hand. It's um, priceless. It's everything I need, they help me with. Even though I don't ask them, they help me anyways. And yet another domestic violence survivor, Naomi Rosado, who was also shot in the head point blank by her boyfriend, was also on hand with her newborn baby boy, a miracle baby indeed. I'm just so happy to for him to be healthy and like, He's so happy at home, and I'm so happy that he's here, that he, like he's completely healthy, there's nothing wrong with him. It's awesome. We've been through a lot with them, and they've been you know, behind us and backing us up, and so it's exciting to actually like kind of let loose and not focus on trial and not focus on and just have some fun and celebrate with them all the stuff we've been through. In what has become a holiday tradition, Steve and Julie's charity, Hands Across the Bay, along with Wheels of Success, and Pure Life Medispa handed over three cars to three deserving families. And they got more than transportation as the team at Hands Across the Bay also filled the trunks with presents. Without Julie's Hands Across the Bay, we wouldn't be able to do this. So we're gonna be presenting three cars this evening to domestic violence survivors. And again, thanks to Julie's Hands Across the Bay, Golden Diamond Source, and Pure Life Medi Spa. It really just gets everybody in the Christmas spirit. I know it gets me in the Christmas spirit. I go and finish all my Christmas shopping every year after that. And it just, it's so exciting to see the smiles on these families' faces and just to wrap everything up for the year. This night will get people in the holiday spirit and we are uh, just pumped and so blessed that Golden Diamond Source does so much for us. You know, this is their VIP holiday party and Hands Across the Bay really shines that here, but it's all about Golden Diamond Source and how much they give to us um, throughout the year. And tonight we celebrate it all together. So proud of my wife and everything she does. And especially with giving away a car, my wife, you know, every year to a family that desperately needs it. It's a used car, but it, you don't gotta ride the bus, you know? So I'm really proud of her and She's amazing. I'm more than excited. I am. I'm so grateful. Um, it's it's been a challenge, and it's such a blessing to have run into you know resources to be able to help me and getting back on my feet. I am. I am just so grateful. Hi. Say thank you. Thank you. It means everything to me. I can get where I need to go and not have to well, drag two kids at 5 a.m. Yeah, in the morning on the you, bus. Uh, and Wheels of Success just, it, for partnering it's with us every day. I get presents, a whole bunch of presents, new toys, a lot of stuff. Is it a good day for you? Yes. I just feel like, I just feel great to be accepted. Very blessed, so grateful for everything they've done for us. Just so much more time to actually live life instead of just struggling to survive. Really excited. I'm very grateful for everybody that has contributed to this, the present wrappers, everybody who donated the presents, uh, the people who donated the car, everybody. Uh, I'm just very grateful and thankful that we've been blessed with this. In addition, Tampa Bay's Dance with the Stars alumni dancers also came out to celebrate the holiday season of giving. They're so welcoming and warming, and uh, I'm really looking forward to getting involved next year as well and attending the, the event, so I'm ex really excited. It's such an amazing feeling to be able to be here tonight to see how that supporting Julie and Steve, we are supporting their charity, and I'm excited to see what they have to offer for the new year. To try and stretch, do something new, something exciting, it was fun, and then to see who you helped. That was the most important part. Exactly. It's such a generous organization. That's what it's all about. Community involvement, supporting each other, and just doing the right thing. And especially this time of the holiday season, it's wonderful. How big this charity is and hands across the bay of helping these people. Julie really does a great job. I can't express it even more. Oh, it's so fun. It's, a, it's such an honor because there are so many great people here. And getting to see some of the old Dancing with the Stars people and some of the people we've been working with. It's just really fun. Yes, it was a great year-end celebration and all about giving back as we get ready for the new year. 
thank you so much, Tampa Bay, for supporting us nonstop through the, over the last few years and especially through 2018. We had a record-breaking year this year, and it's all for you guys. Thank you so much. I want to say thank you so much to everyone who supports Hands Across the Bay and Golden Diamond Source. We truly couldn't do this without you, and you have a hand in every single thing we do for these cars, for these presents, for these families, the survivors, rebuilding. Just thank you so much, and Merry Christmas. We want to thank all of Tampa Bay for all that you guys have done for us, the Golden Diamond Source and Hands Across the Bay. 2018 was a banner year for us. We want you to know we love each and every one of you. Just a heartfelt thank you to everyone in Tampa Bay for the amazing support in 2018. We appreciate everything you do for Hands Across the Bay and Golden Diamond Source. Wow, what an absolute incredible night here at the Golden Diamond Source. A night of celebration, but a night of giving back. From the Golden Diamond Source here in Clearwater for Good Life Tampa Bay, I'm H. John Mejia wishing you a happy holiday season. So for more information, be sure to check out the GoldenDiamondSource.com. That's GoldenDiamondSource.com. Also, the charities at HandsAcrossTheBay.org. That's HandsAcrossTheBay.org. And also, WheelsOfSuccess.org. That's WheelsOfSuccess.org. Hey, do not go anywhere. Stay right where you are. There's more Good Life Tampa Bay to come right after the commercial break. Don't go anywhere. Well, the diamond savings account is the best thing ever because we handpick all the diamonds. We know they're very good diamonds, so we wouldn't mind taking them back. We're proud of our diamond savings account. It's a unique thing that no other jewelry stores really have. You take home another one of our diamonds, which you can eventually get another diamond from, and we get back a diamond we know is good because we handpicked it. We trust what we put out there. And we have customers that have been shopping with us for 30 years and trading up for 30 years, so it's, uh, it's quite an accomplishment. At Health and Med Spa, we believe that you can be sexy, smooth, and confident. Under the supervision of our medical director, Dinar Sejan, MD, come and experience a wide variety of aesthetic services that will help you look and feel your best. Any questions or concerns I had about the treatments, they had all the information to give me and just made me feel very comfortable. If you just get in the space, I feel like that you'll feel comfortable enough to try out other things once you are in, and they can tell you what you're, what's best gonna fit your needs. Health and Med Spa, be sexy, smooth, and confident. In The Zone TV has the experience to handle your project from concept to completion and deliver compelling video communication that grabs audiences' attention. Together, we can create a visual message that can dramatically improve your bottom line. In the Zone TV, video production with marketing power. Good Life Tampa Bay is sponsored by The Golden Diamond Source. Be sure to check out their website at goldendiamondsource.com. In the Zone TV, when you need video production with marketing power, check out their website at inthezonetv.com. And from Health and Med Spa, where you have the right to feel sexy, smooth, and confident. Easy living with technology for home cinemas and smart home automation. Hey, welcome back to Good Life Tampa Bay. Now in this segment, it's all about fun on the golf course, but more importantly, it's all about helping kids. Let's take a look. Hey everybody, it's H. John here from the Good Life Tampa Bay TV show, and today we're at the beautiful and spectacular Cypress Run Golf Club for a charity event, the 2018 Tampa Bay Invitational Pro-Am, benefiting the Dana-Farber Institute and also the National Pediatric Cancer Foundation. A lot of fun on the course, all for a great cause, so let's check it out. Cypress Run is one of the Bay Area's premier private club. Since 1981, the Cypress Run Golf Club has been the prestigious address for those seeking the finest in golf, food and beverage, special celebration events, as well as camaraderie with fellow members and guests. Today, they were proud to serve as the venue host and the big sponsor for the inaugural 2018 Tampa Bay Invitational Pro-Am Charity Event. We're so happy to have this here. Uh, this is a, a premier event for us this year. And uh, as you know, we just did a renovation upstairs. And uh, this is our first big event for uh, an event, so we're very happy. A couple of the owners played in the tournament and um, obviously very supportive of this, and we want to have you back next year. This charity golf tournament will have all the net proceeds donated to the Dana-Farber Institute and the National Pediatric Cancer Foundation. The Dana-Farber Cancer Institute is a comprehensive cancer treatment and research center in Boston, Massachusetts, committed to providing adults and children with cancer with the best treatment available today while developing tomorrow's cures through cutting-edge research. The National Pediatric Cancer Foundation is all about making a big difference in the lives of children who are battling cancer. Their vision is to build a world where every child and parent 
has the peace of mind knowing there is hope with their research to end pediatric cancer. We are so excited to pair up this year with um, Isabel and Steve. They started the idea of having a golf tournament here at this beautiful Cypress Run, and we jumped right on board. So today, all the money that comes in, all these wonderful golfers and sponsors, we're so thrilled to have them to support these kids that are in need of the less toxic, more targeted um, cures to specialize because today most of the money from the government goes to adult cancers. So only 4% comes to pediatrics. So if we don't cure our children, there will be no adults in our future. Two children cancer survivors were on hand at today's charity event to help share the importance of providing this support. In May of 2017, I was diagnosed with uh, ALL leukemia and uh, I'm still under treatment now, but I have about like two years left. I'm a two-time cancer survivor myself. I've been in remission for about 13 years. It was rough in the beginning for about an eight-month period of frontline treatment, but now, you know, it's a little bit easier. And my family's gotten through it, and I couldn't have done it without my family and my friends. A tremendous support system, but I'm doing great, and I'm thankful, you know, for how blessed I am. Because of things like this golf tournament, and if Things like this weren't available to raise money for the Pediatric Cancer Foundation and other organizations like them to raise money for cancer awareness, then I would not be here today. So I'm here to give back for that organization. Well, being a cancer survivor myself and, and fighter, uh, I like to give back to the you know system that saved my life. And also I aspire to have a career in this field, you know, possibly like my doctor, pediatric oncologist. And I think this is a great foundation where I can you know, give back to such a great cause. Many local sports celebrities were on hand as former Bucks, Rays, and Lightning players came out for the cause. This was a great event for a great cause. Uh, and we had a lot of great people here and it's just, just wonderful that someone would take this kind of challenge to raise money for a situation like this, so it's, it's, it's great. It was awesome, it was, we had a great day today, and the weather was perfect. I mean, it's December, and it's like, well, I think it might have been 78 or 80 degrees today. So everything was awesome, and we had a great time. Yeah, I do uh, quite a few of these charity events, um, trying to uh, get out and uh, do as many as I can. Um, getting a little old now, the body doesn't really uh, cooperate too much, but I like uh, the social event of golfing, and uh, I wish my golf game was a little bit better, but it's not, so we're working on it. In addition to Cypress Run Golf Club, there were many other sponsors who supported this event, including Tito's Vodka and Glory Days Grill, among many others. Oh, it's always a great opportunity to come out and support the community and support the charities that, that need our support and meet all these great people that are out here doing the same thing. This event is fantastic and we notified Tito's and they were very excited about the cause and they donated all their vodka and I get the the great job of pouring all the vodka and so we're making two of the best drinks in the whole house and I'm the favorite person here. Over 120 golfers absolutely love the event venue and had an incredible day and evening enjoying themselves while helping make a difference. Each team had a professional golfer that helped them compete in a Pinehurst scramble format. Their day included incredible golf, a buffet breakfast, numerous lunch stations on the course, and admission to the dinner award ceremony after where they enjoyed incredible food, a unique silent auction items, champagne grotto, and multiple live auction opportunities. Now on the golf course, there are lots of guys out there showing their game competing. Well, everything here it, it, is a great cause, and that's exactly what we're doing. We're trying to support it, and we've got a great showing of people today. Everybody seems to be having a good time. A lot of good food, a lot of good golf. Yeah, I lost a brother to cancer three years ago, and uh, it's a special thing in my heart. So. Uh, Steve Martin called me and uh, no chance I wouldn't miss so we're here we're happy and uh, we're having a good time and representing my brother and many others that have uh, fought this battle. I think this is a great day we lucked out with the weather and having so much fun and uh, so happy to be playing with Chris and the rest of my foursome. Great pro having a good time Susie what a great neighbor, and it's a fun event and for a good cause. It's a great cause. Uh, I have three family members that have suffered from cancer in one form or another, so this is really dear to the heart, and we're just so pleased to be here and support the great uh, efforts of the event. I mean, that's what really matters, even though we're having fun. It's the bottom line. That's what, uh, at the end of the day, that's what really matters. Oh, yeah, it's great. It's great to be out here for a good cause and to, to play with a lot of good people. Uh, you know, golf is a game where you can always get back and, that's what we try to do best as golf professionals. I mean, it's great. I mean, anything you need, we have a professional here showing us 
things that we would have never thought of, reads on the on the green, anything we want. I mean, it's it's great. Uh, it's amazing. This is a great cause for children, and at the same time, playing with a pro who really is so much fun around us and really such a laid-back guy. It's a great cause. I think we'll have a great time, a uh, great cause, and we love it, man. Um, it's for the children. It's just an easy game. That putt was a piece of cake. But when you play as badly as I play today, it's a victory not to walk off the course clinically depressed, okay? Well, we've had a terrific day down here today. Couldn't have done it without these guys. We're having a great time. Oh, first class the whole way. Uh, everything was perfect, well done. Uh, great day of golf. It's all, it's all about the cause. It's all about the cause and the camaraderie and watching Sandy make all those putts she made today. It was great fun. I wasn't expecting to play today. I actually came out to volunteer, so I lucked out. Yeah, I couldn't have got put with a better group of guys. I mean, we didn't plan this. It just kind of happened. It got put together and uh, everything from, you know, registration to golf has been great. Yeah, it's been a good event. Oh, it couldn't be a better day. This is a great golf course, great time, and a great uh, event for the, and a great charity. Yeah, it's been fantastic. I can say more. It's been perfect. It's been perfect. It, it couldn't have been better, I, I forgot to say. It's the best venue we've ever had. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. Uh, we had a wonderful field today, great weather. Uh, I think we had 120 players, and uh, just wonderful to be a part of it. I've been carrying these guys all day. I thought that was wonderful. It, was, it went in the, the whole way it was going in. I think it's great for the kids. Uh, I think we had a pretty good day. A lot of people came out. Hopefully they made it, raised a lot of money for the kids. Uh, the excitement was getting to spend four and a half hours out here with uh, three people that I never met before. And, and that's the most exciting part is meeting new people and then of course uh, giving back to you know a great cause. Just because it's for the children, and yeah, you know, that's all it's about, and just helping the, the community. What a great cause. It hits many families. You never know if it's going to be your family or your, your friend's family. It has been beautiful out here. Everything has been amazing. And like he said, cancer touches everybody's family, so for us to be able to get out here and give back has just been amazing for us. We had a blast out here today. Now, after the heavy competition, the award ceremony dinner with a jazz band was quite impressive. We've really enjoyed being uh, a sponsor here. I mean, Cancer affects everybody. Like you, you don't know anybody that hasn't been affected by cancer. So, and even for children, it's a it's a separate, a whole separate issue. And so, it's been really great to be a part of that and help do some research, funding, and everything. Now, tonight, one of the many highlights included a live wine auction. Oh, that was that was a great auction. We we had wine from all over the world, like best of the red wine that uh, the world of wine can make. So that was very interesting, uh, that was a good action. Well, the energy is obviously very high in the room. I mean, everyone's here for a good cause. Not only is it a fun event with a lot of fun stuff going on, but everyone's here for a bigger reason. Everyone here has really open hearts and obviously some very open pocketbooks too. So we're supporting a lot tonight. It's very exciting. You know, as the evening wrapped up, all in attendance had a lot of fun in giving back. That was for a great cause, and it's always nice to be involved in something like this. The uh, course was great, beautiful day, a little windy, but other than that, it's been a great day, and all the uh, uh, festivities have been fantastic. It was wonderful. Everybody was so kind and helping out, and smiles everywhere, and really, it was fun. Uh, we are very proud. I mean, this, this has been uh, the best uh, it, we could have wished for. First, we, we thought it was going to rain. It never rained. Uh, it didn't even sprinkle, so that's good. Uh, and, uh, you know, the, the outpouring of our friends and family and the uh, support of the club and the generosity of everybody uh, is really testament to, you know, how good people they are and how much they want to really help. I, I hope it seems flawless. We tried our best. Um, I think we, are, we were, um, the club has done a wonderful job. And also we had a few uh, restaurants on course. Um, I think every all the players uh, had a good time. Uh, we were very lucky with the weather, no rain, and we expected rain. So all in all, it has been a very successful day. The inaugural 2018 Tampa Bay Invitational Pro-Am was a complete success. Thank you so much for coming out today. Without people like you, I may not be alive. Kids like me may not be alive, and it, it, I just I can't thank you enough. And uh, I'm looking forward to being out here next year, and hopefully I can see some of you guys out here again next year. So uh, thank you. I thank everybody, everybody support for the cancer world, pediatric especially. I can't thank you enough from the bottom of my heart. I want to represent National Pediatric Cancer, our families, and our kids. Without you and your support, we wouldn't be able to give these kids a fighting chance. 
So thank you for being here today, and we appreciate everything you've done for us. God bless. Take care. Wow, what an absolutely incredible day and evening. And that's a wrap here from the 2018 Tampa Bay Invitational Pro-Am. For Good Luck Tampa Bay, I'm H. John Mejia, and we absolutely look forward to seeing you here next year. So be sure to get involved in next year's event and keep up to date at tbiproam.com. That's tbiproam.com. Oh, hey, don't go anywhere. There's more Good Life Tampa Bay to come right after the commercial break and after I practice a few more chip shots. Family owned and operated means a lot to me because all my parents, all my brothers, aunts and uncles are here. Adam and Emily, our youngest two, just joined the company and it's so great to have them here. Now we have literally come to work and we have all five of our children here working in the company. I mean, you walk into the store and it feels just like home. You feel how much people care and you see that with my siblings and I especially. We all love working together. We all have a great time. You can feel the love when you walk in the doors. At Health and Med Spa, we believe that you can be sexy, smooth, and confident. Under the supervision of our medical director, Dinar Sejan, MD, come and experience a wide variety of aesthetic services that will help you look and feel your best. Any questions or concerns I had about the treatments, they had all the information to give me and just made me feel very comfortable. If you just get in the space, I feel like that you'll feel comfortable enough to try out other things once you are in, and they can tell you what you're, what's best gonna fit your needs. Health and Med Spa, be sexy, smooth, and confident. In The Zone TV has the experience to handle your project from concept to completion and deliver compelling video communication that grabs audiences' attention. Together, we can create a visual message that can dramatically improve your bottom line. In the Zone TV, video production with marketing power. Good Life Tampa Bay is sponsored by The Golden Diamond Source. Be sure to check out their website at goldendiamondsource.com. In the Zone TV, when you need video production with marketing power, check out their website at inthezonetv.com. And from Health and Med Spa, where you have the right to feel sexy, smooth, and confident. Easy living with technology for home cinemas and smart home automation. All right, welcome back to Good Life Tampa Bay. Unfortunately, that's a wrap for this episode. We want to thank you for watching. We hope you've enjoyed the show as much as we've enjoyed producing it for you. I want to take this moment to thank our sponsors, Steve and Julie Weintraub from the Golden Diamond Source, our production company, In The Zone TV, Dr. Dinar Sejan and Usman Izad from Health and Psychiatry. On behalf of the entire Good Life Tampa Bay team, I'm H. John Mejia, and we look forward to seeing you on our next show. Tonight we're at the Golden Diamond Source. Three, two, one. Tonight we're at the Golden Diamond Source. Three, two, one. Wow, what an absolutely incredible night here at the Golden Diamond Source. Three, two, one. Hey, everybody, it's H. John Mejia, host of the Good Life Tampa Bay TV show, and today we are Cypress Run. Cypress, Cypress, Cypress.